Welcome everyone. Six Flags has sent out a email to participate in a survey about some possible new experiences they might have in store for other parks. Uh, as I learned last year by accident, if you take the survey and then try to take it again, you'll get different choices. So I took the survey once legitimately, uh, entered my uh, true feelings, and then I just kept going back and um, checking out the other options, just not submitting the survey again. So I took the survey once, and then I just kind of went back and forth, back and forth to get some of the other options to see um, what kind of uh, experiences they are considering. So first, uh, I came upon a Firefly drone show. Look at that, Caleb. Wow. So that looks cool. It does look cool. I, th I uh, think that'd be neat if they would, you know, pull something like that off. Enjoy a drone-based show that will give you a spectacular experience floating high in the sky. Uh, the second choice I got, an augmented reality scavenger hunt. When the clues can be hidden literally anywhere, you have to be creative. Go on a journey with your phone through the park. So I thought that would be kind of fun to do. They yeah. do that stuff at, like, Disney. Um, jugglers. You thought you knew juggling until you see the Six Flags, Six Flags jugglers. Come watch as they juggle. You know, mm -hmm. whatever. Okay. You know, mm -hmm. it's, it's something. Okay. A show. So, I mean, I could see them. I can see them putting that in our park. Acme Fun Factory, our Toontastic testing facility where you can use your strength, wits, agility, and put your Toontastic products to the test. Hmm. I don't really understand what this yeah, is. I, don't really know what it is. I guess it's for kids? Like six? Not really sure. A luau. You'll be transported to Hawaii during our luau, which features traditional food, music, and dancing. Hey, if it's on the dining plan, I'm in. If not, I, I don't know if I'm going to spend money to enjoy this experience, but, you know, why not? Extreme Stunt Show. Yo. Six Flags St. Louis, in particular, has not had a stunt show in a while. Mind-bending backflips, amazing corkscrews, and stuff like that. I think it'd be fun for the park. They used to do, like, dolphin shows and that looks cool. different shows, and they haven't really had any in a while. DC-themed mm -hmm. laser light show. Watch your favorite superheroes and supervillains bail it out. I think this would be neat. A nighttime show. Um, they don't really have anything like that at our park. I can see them putting that in in some park. Is there just going to be like one of these? Um, well, they're just, you know, stuff. A fun house. Go on a mind-bending, explorable experience as you walk through a mirror mazes and more. I think that'd be kind of fun. You know, they, ha they, put they have like a grandfather's mansion at Silver Dollar City, but they don't really have any kind of fun house at Six Flags St. Louis. I don't know where they put it. Heroes in Training. Ever wondered what it took to become a superhero? Now you can find out. It's kind of a walk-through experience. And I assume there's different attractions inside i don't think this will come to six flags st louis but you know it's always something to consider i said absolutely no. heck no. to the gnaw dinner in the sky i am not floating up this does not look appealing to me at all wait you could just fall out so <laughs> I'm, I'm sure somebody would like to do that but i don't see six flags spending the money and you i'm sure it would cost a fortune so vr bumper oh cars God, i think this looks really cool of course with today's society and yeah. Sanitizing, sanitization, I don't know how that would work with virtual reality in the park, but, you know, we could use bumper cars. Paddle boats? Mm. Well, currently we don't really have a lake at Six Flags St. Louis, but I'm sure a park that does have some kind of lake or pond, why not? You know, paddle boats. Wait, is this just for Six Flags St. Louis? It's, it's, for, it's for all the parks. Oh. VR whitewater rafting. Again, I've seen these kind of things um, in... I don't know, amusement parks and stuff like that. Sure, fun. it'd be fun. I just don't see how they would do with COVID. People would want to be wearing the same headset as other people. Virtual reality maze. That looks fun. Free roam through a maze while interacting with your favorite characters. Don't spend too much time talking. You never know what is around the corner. I'm all in for that. Mm -hmm. um, same with like the... Same thing with the virtual yeah. reality, but I think it'd be fun. Gyroscope flights. No, I'm not getting in this thing. Take think. your thrills to a new level and riding in a gyrocopter. They're never going to bring this to yeah. Six Flags St. Yeah, Louis. Same with like the diner on the It's side. not very scenic, but I can see maybe if you're like by an ocean or another park, maybe oh, yeah, a helicopter fun. flight. Yeah, yeah. We just have like hills and mountains. By another me. VR simulator. They seem to be going really all in on these VR stuff. That looks um, really fun. Again, sure. I'm sure there'd be an upcharge. It does look like fun. Looks but, like they're an egg. But who knows? I... I don't know if they would ever become virtual restaurant windows. Now they have this at Disney. They just Whoa. started a space 220 where you go in and you feel like you're in space. It looks like here they're doing where you could feel like you're in like a zoo or in Gotham, or in Gotham City. I think this would be cool yeah. to go into a restaurant and have the uh, 
the cool windows like that. Why, they want to. Do you think they'll bring the world wrestling entertainment to Six Flags? Yeah. Make sure you're for the throwdown. I mean, we don't really have a spot in our park for this, but I'd go if they had some kind of like arena. I mean, all that land we have. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Dutch Wheel. This is a no for me. We what already we already have one in downtown Six Flags St. Louis. Oh, that we already have the Colossus here. So there's no there's no yeah. reason at all this would ever come to our park. Maybe yeah. another park that doesn't have a wheel or a city that doesn't have a wheel. Zipline Racer. There's not really something like this around here. They have a lot in Branson. Well, they have a lot of Merrimack Cavern stuff like that. Uh, I can see them constructing some kind of zipline. It'll be definitely an upcharge, but you know why not put it in. Base jumping, to no for me, but I'm sure someone would love to do it. That looks fun. <laughs> You're going to do a base jump? I mean, I'm terrified. <laughs> what about game shows? Now, I can see them doing something like this. Is is it Jeopardy. Have some kind Wait, of no, um, Jeopardy, yeah, family, feud. family feud. Yeah, I would definitely be in on this if they would put something like this in the park. They have all kinds of little theaters they could put this in. So that was just some of the... Um, some of the options, I, again, you only when you do the survey, you only get three. So I had to click back and forth, back and forth to get all these uh, options. And I think some of them look interesting. Again, will any of them even come? Probably not to our park. But I it's, mean, maybe like the, um... it's fun to um, you know speculate and just at least they're trying something to see interest, engage interest and stuff like that. I can see a game show like this coming. I can see... Some of the other virtual reality things possibly coming if they can do the sanitization correctly. I can see like some of the stuff going, but it's yeah. not going to look like the pictures. Yeah, like, I mean, this is for all the Six Flags, so I mean, the more bigger and better yeah, parks have more opportunities to get Saint stuff Louis like is this. Not the biggest part so, of all of them. what do you guys think? Let us know in the comments below. Until we see our next survey, may the adventure continue. Like, subscribe, blah blah blah.